Hello Zebra Herd, welcome back to LEGO DC Super Villains. And today we are continuing our exploration through Apocalypse, hopefully able to explore and collect everything else. I just tried to get this at the end of the last episode, the Matrimony and Magma, it wasn't working, so we're just gonna start doing some other things, some races, some other missions and stuff, and see what ends up happening with it. Hopefully everything turns out pretty well. Um, and yeah, we can get ever so closer to completing the game, that'll be a lot of fun. Uh, for now, I am going this way. It looks like we got ourselves a lot of rings to get through, so let's get through that one. And don't forget this one. The flying is definitely the way to do this one for sure. Got it. Okay, so far, so good. Oh my. Ready, set, got it. And it looks like we need to get 22 in total. We got a long way to go then. Only a minute 20 to do it as well. I mean, we're making some good time so far. More than halfway through it already. Without even half the time used, so I, I guess we're gonna be fine. Oh, I like seeing all the planets in the distance out in the sky over there, pretty cool. So I guess this is like how we're in Apocalypse right now is back where Apocalypse, no, no, Apocalypse is still over the Earth. Because I know after, you only get to explore Apocalypse after the main story. The great royal family of Latava. And I think that after the main story, Apocalypse gets sent back, doesn't it? As far as I remember. Okay, so another race down this way. That's pretty handy. You know, we just stop at one race, start another. So start right here, this one requires an acrobatic character. Uh, well, I know that Harley Quinn is. Let's start this race. And we have a minute and 10 seconds to... Whoa, whoa, I was not expecting that. I didn't even see that launch pad. Got this one. Going this way. Very good so far. Um, where are we going now? Where was that supposed to lead? Uh, oh, this way, okay. I was a little confusing. Got a minute and 10 seconds in total to this one. We're already a third through it. Six out of 18, wait, really? Okay, switch over to li uh, live wire real fast. Okay, can she make this jump? She can't, oh, are you serious? That's actually really silly. Um, Quickly, 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 I don't have much time to do this. Oh, I gotta retry. That's sort of baloney though. Okay, come on. Can she, is she acrobatic? I don't think she counts as acrobatic. Um, all right. You know what, I'm switching to Harley Quinn. And then what I'm gonna do, and I know this is totally cheating, but you know what, they allow it to happen. Is that, I don't think it'll, oh no, it'll let me do it as Flash. Well that's good. And then go on this jump pad, get launched up this way, and just be able to zoom through this stuff like it's nothing, because it will be like it's nothing. There we go. And then we can like jump across this a whole lot easier than I fall. But that's okay, because I can now switch over to Harley Quinn, who I guess has a second jump. I mean, some of them have a double jump. Are you serious? Why? <laughs> Why? Why would you make the jump over this? Okay, come on. I guess when you, I don't know, what the heck? That is weird. Try this again. You just gotta be careful over that circle bit, but uh, easier said than done, right? Whoa. Okay, go quickly. Got it, and then jump and jump, and then jump. Okay, so you don't really need it too much. There we go, flying through this one. And this is where things might get a little scary. Yikes, ooh, that must have hurt. Because it's sort of hard to tell, oh no. Because I can't make this jump now. Uh, quickly switch to Harley Quinn again. I guess this is why you can't always do that. Okay, what the heck though? Like she couldn't jump up there either. We're try, we're try, we're try. Oh man, that's weird. That is just plain weird, and I am not where I was before. Okay, well where is that going to be? Yeah, put the put the marker back on the race. That's down this way. We'll just try it through and through as Harley Quinn this time and see if it doesn't just do random baloney stuff, you know? Weird, very weird. One of the few, few ones you can't cheat, I guess. I mean, I could just switch to a flying character immediately. That way I don't have to even risk getting stuck. And if I mess up again, I definitely am, because I'm getting a little tired of doing this one. Thought it was gonna be cool at first, and then it turned out not being as cool as I was hoping. This jump in particular is a pain, because if you're not like directly on top, like you get stuck on it very, very easy, and then like my second jump was just taken away from me for no reason. That's really upsetting. <laughs> okay, go down to this one. Got it, got it, and I know it's sort of lame for me to do this, but like, it's not fair. <laughs> okay, oh, she didn't hit the wall. So that gives us a little extra time even. Got it. Why is that not working? There it is. Uh, guess we need to use the launch pad for this one. 
No, she hit the wall that time. Got it. And we're almost out of time already. Okay, well that was the last one. I've stolen better than this before. If only I cared. Um, so let's move forward. I got a race over this. We're gonna do all the races first, because most of the races are fun. When they're not being baloney, they're really fun. Let's try this one out. Uh, if there is a race to be had, I need a vehicle of some sort, so let's spawn one in. Uh, we'll just do, th Robin's bike's always pretty fun, if it'll fit. Uh, don't know what is happening with this camera, so let's use something smaller that'll actually fit in this area. Okay. Start the race. And go. So this one, a minute and 30 seconds for 30 rings might be a little bit of a challenge. Maybe should have used a car. Some of the cars handle a little bit more easily. They don't go as fast. I think it might just be easier to jump off and drive uh, and run around as flash as well. Okay, it definitely would be. So let me quickly switch over to the flash. Like this, oh gosh. Come on, come on quickly. Got it? Oh, does it not count if you're not in the vehicle? It may not. Um, there we go. Maybe it doesn't count if you're not in the vehicle. Let me try again. It doesn't, oh, that's smarter than the do. All right, well, let me just like fall in the lava. Will that like restart the race for me? It won't. Why is it when I'm trying to fail this one, it won't end? What happened to my vehicle? Uh, isn't that bizarre? That when I'm actually trying to make it end, it doesn't end? Okay, finally. It took a while. Uh, retry for sure. And uh, let me spawn that back in. And I hope it's not gonna be in the way of the race now. That would sort of stink. Okay, why is it stuck? This game is giving me a thousand and one issues right now. Gotta be honest. And start the race. There it is. All right, everybody's gonna have to move out of the way. This thing is big. Maybe a little too big. Uh, whoa. It's a pretty cool car though. I don't know whose it is. Is it Batman's? Wow, wow, wow. Okay, let us try to get out of this thing. Okay, got it. No, I'm stuck. No, I'm not, no, I'm not, I'm fine, I'm fine. This is really weird. <laughs> See, there's the other one. Okay, hop into that one real fast. No, hop into it. Flash, you're failing me right now. This is not fast at all, Flash, and that's your whole thing, so. Oh my gosh, this is ridiculous. Oh no, he, he's stuck, it's stuck! He's just not going anymore. What the heck? Whoa! <laughs> this is the wonkiest thing ever. We're only halfway through. We're also only halfway through our time, so it's actually working out pretty decent. If I just get through some of these faster, like that. Ow, oh, that, you should really wear a helmet with this thing. Come on, don't get stuck. All right, that thing's properly out of the way now. Are you serious? Come on, I'm getting through it, I'm getting through it. There it is. Okay, I only got 20 seconds left for eight more of them. Time is not seemingly on my side at the moment. Oh no, that's a very thin platform. Oh, come on, come on. This is a really bad choice of vehicle. Oh, come on, come on, come on, no! <laughs> what the heck? You can't be serious. I gotta do it over again. Oh my gosh, the races have not been good on Apocalypse so far. I don't like it. All right, well, I might as well start shopping around for a vehicle that actually work. I mean, I guess the Red Devil will work. It's just also very wobbly to control at times. And everything else is like too big. So let me retry. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how weird that is. Um, you will use, uh, not Red Devil, Red Hoods. All right. And wait, switch back over. Start the race. And let's try this. Got it. Okay, so far so good. Okay, this is turning out a little bit better. It's just, sometimes this can be just as much of a problem and there's just as much of a risk I'm gonna fall into the lava with this thing because it's a little finicky. Which is why I would rather just run around as the Flash. That's the most fun option anyways. Okay, I got that. What, whoa, that was weird. I don't like it. So we're more than halfway through now. Come on. Oh, got it. 
No, watch with that little lip. Bounces me up. This is a super weird one, I gotta be honest. Come on. I, I'm just trying to turn around, this is maddening. This is really upsetting, I can't get up this. It's just like, this is not me. You guys have seen me do a thousand different races. It's it's not me, I promise. It's just, it's not a really good area for racing a vehicle. I'm stuck again. Okay, I don't know what happens there, but you lose all acceleration. No. Ooh, I don't have much time to do this. Go, 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 go. If we can just drive in a straight line. Oh my gosh! You can't be serious! That's the second time in a row that's happened. Go. No! What the heck? The controls are so bad around here. Oh, I'm going insane. No, get on the bike. Get on the bike. Ah, oh, I give up. What the heck? So let's try this again. I'm gonna go incredibly slow. There it is. Oh my gosh. Ah! Oh, we made it. I don't care. Fastest man alive. I'm the fastest zebra alive, thank you very much. Was that all the races? Maybe that meant we did every race in the game. Interesting, so now we got missions to tackle, like this guy over here. Where is this one then? No one Just right over this way. Won't be enough. What was his name, Mr. Something? Hi. My wife Barda is mad at me. I've been spending too much money on escape room experiences when we should be saving. I need to make it up to her, but buying a gift will make it worse. Oh no. I've decided to retrieve something of ours from Granny Goodness's orphanage. It's where we first met, you know. Unfortunately, my expertise is in escaping, not entering. Okay, so let's accept. Um, right. now let's I guess we're just gonna follow him. The okay. But there's so many things more you can do to make it up to somebody besides spending money on them, you know? You could just spend some quality time with them, make them a nice dinner. Hey, state your business. I'm escorting uh. this woman for Granny Goodness's book club. You wouldn't want to keep Granny waiting, would you? No, of course not. Please proceed. All right, well, Granny goes into this orf orphanage. I can't believe that worked. All right, now we just have to find my old room. Okay, your old room. Is it up the here? The door's locked. Can you get it open? I'm no good at this. I'll try. So we need a character like Batman or something. Kind of thing. Well, you're right. I still don't have to be happy about it. I suppose you don't. And let's try that thing. There it is. Well done. Now let's see what we can find. Ooh. All right, I'm gonna bust some things open. Was that it? Aww. Aww. Of us as kids. This is perfect. You look exactly the same. <laughs> so go ahead and yeah. grab this. There are a few things in this room we can take. Keep looking. Oh yeah, Barda's favorite teddy bear. This was our favorite toy to play with as kids. Okay, well. This should be enough. Now, let's get out of here. Oh no, sorry. Uh, so what are we doing now? We just gotta still follow you? The job's not done at getting you the objects. We gotta also make sure you get back safely. So I just discovered that breaking into a room is the same as breaking out of one, but the door opens the other way. It's all starting to make sense now. Great. Thanks for your help. I'm sure Barda will love these old mementos. I thought it was quite easy, so we unlocked Mr. Miracle. Uh, what is the next one we want to tackle then? There's some stuff around us, sure, I'm sure of it. Like, we're right here already? Weren't we? I don't know where we were. Anyways, let's do this one, Furious Fisticuffs. And can I switch to a character that can fly? Or maybe I could just do it like this for now. Ooh, nice, mid-air dash. Oh, hello. Can I talk to you? Or no? Let me like leave yes. and come back, yep, there we go, this that worked. This new batch of Proto Furies is coming along nicely. You seem like you have the same voice actor as the granny lady. Hi. Welcome, short one. As you can tell from my commanding height, I am Big Barda. Prepare yourself for the Proto Furies flurry. You're looking exactly the same size, oh, okay. You aren't prepared at all. Do not worry, tiny one, I shall explain. You will face my finest fighters as they are itching for combat and must be tested in the heat of battle. Okay. So it's accept. Let us not dilly dally around. Put up your guard and prepare for the fight at your own. Oh my! Now Here they are. Alright, uh, we'll just fight all these guys then. Furies, do not hold back. We are the unstoppable force. How many do we have to beat up? Twenty of them. Wow! Some of these aren't even like fighters. They're just people, like scientists and waitresses. 
All right. I mean, not to say they can't fight, but they're just like not in proper fighting attire. No, my battery's low. That's the real thing they're trying to do against me. Just wear out my controller battery. You've got to learn to walk before you can run. I've seen better battle formations in Granny Goodness's retirement home. All right, so how many more are left? Uh, was that all of them? May have been. Batman helped me beat up a couple of them too, but she doesn't have much to say about it, so. I'm not sure. Do I have to beat you up next? No. All right, well, what gives? Did one of them like fall off the side? Because that's definitely something that would happen. Oh, yep. Where did you come from? Who knows? It would appear my proto furies are somewhat lacking fury, along with guile and pretty much everything else. I must forge them into deadly fighters before I can present them to Granny Goodness. All right. Thank you for being the most worthy punching bag in Apocalypse. You have shown my proto furies the value of a skilled fighter. Until we meet again, small one. I guess All right, see ya. this makes it the runner up prize. <laughs> Anyone? No. Nope. All right, so uh, with that one done, that's another character, is Big Barda. There is something over this way. I'll switch to a flying character real fast and try to figure that one out. It was over here, yeah. So this is gonna be another one of those little chest things that has just a character showing out on it. Super duper easy, just go in here, punch it up, and we get Red Tornado. So, so with that one done, what else do we have going on around here? I have this right here, this is Batty Issues. We'll try that out. So, get over this way. And I don't see anybody over here yet, but I'm sure they're just loading in. Maybe. I'll show oh, you, there they Dad. are. Orion. Hi, Orion. You know, I can deal with him constantly trying to take over the world, ignoring me and forgetting my birthday. I can even deal with him sending me away to try and bring some peace. But when he's been on this massive mission to find the anti-life equation, which I know, and he still doesn't even think to ask me, well, that just shows how bad a father dark side is. I'm gonna check this place. That'll show him. So he knew it. He knew the anti-life equation the entire time? Wow. All right, so yeah, we'll definitely help this guy out, I suppose. Uh, So where are we going, up this way? Or we're just gonna follow him around. He looks really silly on that scooter, I gotta be honest. Hmm, go up this way, and here they are. Okie doke. Get these things if we can. Called parademons. I mean, they can fly. They don't parachute or paraglide. Why aren't they called arrow demons or something? Ask Super Mario. <laughs> sure, there's a reason. I'd ask my dad if he ever talked to me. <laughs> Yikes. All right. Um, was is that good or is there more? There's this guy. Oh, he has a golden armor on. Okay, let's go ahead and switch to somebody like Heat Wave. No, not the scientist, dude. Heat Wave. All right, we got Hugo Strange apparently. Uh, move it. We can't. We can't. We can't get him unless we melt his armor. Did we get it? No, not quite. And got him. There we go. Keep moving. So, what is going on this way? Oh, running on this way. <laughs> That's sort of a scary jump to make, but all right. Keep following him. Oh, here come a lot more. Get these guys up however we can then. Kite man was going to call his goons parademons for a while. He dropped that pretty quick after a chat with my dad. <laughs> yeah, I think that uh, Dark Side sort of is a couple levels above Kite Man, unfortunately. I'm sure if Kite Man practices up though, he can take him. I believe in him. Anyways, let's go ahead and beat that dude up from way over here if we can. Oh no, that's another uh, guy with metal armor. So we can get rid of him like that. That is perfect. Times five multiplier at the moment, pretty crazy. Let's make it higher. Come on, times six, times seven. Oh boy, and there's still more coming in. So we can make this a times nine. What about a times 10, you bet. That is gonna be so many studs. So many studs. Got him, come on. Don't let this streak end. Where'd he go, where'd he go? Pick that up. Whoa, that was like a 100 million studs, just right there. Can't get any higher than times 10, unfortunately. But we can at least like refresh it. That was like 40 million studs. I think. 
Dude, that got me 40 million more stats, just right there. Crazy, 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 crazy. So, um, oh no, ooh. Yep, okay, I switched to you just in time. What more can we find over this way? I need to keep breaking stuff. This right, I'll get a, oh no, the time sign is over. Oh well. Hello. I guess I was gonna get the four billion in no time. So Curious. we're almost there. You know, Got more guys to beat sorry. up, luckily. As much as I'm mad at my dad for trading me off, at least I didn't have to live with Granny Goodness. Yeah. All right. Uh, whoa. These are all Granny Goodness troops, I suppose. Maybe now you'll pay attention to me. Okay. Excuse me, dude. Come on, come on, come on. Got him. This lady still has that golden armor. I've been trying to melt it down, but everybody else gets in our way. Come on, come on, come on. It's still not broken? Are you serious? There it goes. No, it's, you have impenetrable armor apparently. It just ain't working. There it goes, finally. I think there was another one with metal armor. Maybe not. I'll have to wait and see. For now, go for you. Got it. Going back up to times 10, hopefully. Get you. There it is, times 10. Pick up these studs quick. And then, oh wait, get these studs real fast. Got it. Can you watch it, lady? Let me attack. Is our multiplier's about to end. There it is, there it is. It's speeding back up a little bit. Okay, and this lady over here. Stop, you jerk. There it is, awesome. <laughs> uh, that felt pretty good. I know this didn't actually achieve that much, and my real dad, Isaiah, is great. I just need to get some anger out every now and then, you know? So this isn't actually your dad? Anyway, thanks for helping me. You ever need a new god on your side, give me a shout. Oh, okay. Finally. Maybe now so we I got Orion. Start getting a little more respect around here. Pretty cool. So with that one done, there is still more to explore. Of course, there is this over here. This is Stompa Stomper. Um, and that's 22 meters down that way. And then we're like almost done for this area. And after that, I don't know what we do next, to be honest with you. She won't um, be getting the stomp on me this time around. We'll see about that. Hi, how are Last you? Last time I faced Stompa was back when I was in the squad at Bell Rav. It uh didn't work out so well for me. This time, Things will be different. I'll scope her out way in advance. Before I can start hunting for info on Stampa, I need a minute to gather my bearings. Those boom tube things are surprisingly disorienting. Until I'm ready, you think you could gather some intel on Stampa for me? Sure. Okay, Those so let's accept that mission. Surprisingly talkative, you know? Guess they don't get out much. So we just gotta talk to a couple of guys. That shouldn't be too bad to do. Um, just gotta find out where they are, and that's always the challenge. Apparently still up. Up, up, up. And do I see him around here? Nope, still up more. Uh, up on this balcony, maybe? I do see somebody, hi! Stompa's costume, cool. Could be Earth Sports Star. <laughs> <laughs> A sports star, cool. Uh, so there's that one over this way. Way over this way. I got something. Yeah, I can already see the guy in that building right over there. Uh, hello. How are you? <laughs> you not beat Stompa. <laughs> she too strong. If you say so. What about this one way over this way? There's something, all right. Oh, is it this guy? It has to be this guy. Yeah. What's up? Stompa strong. <laughs> we no match for her stomp. Her stomps shake ground. Okay. And two more over this way, and then that's it. Way down here. Apparently, uh, might be on the other side of this little thing. It's looking like it. Uh, let's grab this thing. There it is. And hi. Uh, oh, big boot scare me. <laughs> Special antimatter shoes hurt parrot demons. <laughs> oh no. Okay, so. One more down this way, apparently. Or around, oh, right here. Oh, is he a chef? He looks like a chef. Nothing stops Stompa, except maybe love. Love conquer all. Love conquers all. Alrighty, well that's everything we need to know then. We just need to get back over to this dude. Where was the entrance to this? Uh, right over here, I think. Maybe, potentially. 
Well, yeah, it's just telling me to go through this way. And then the hop down. Eee, I made it. Hi. What have you got for me? Uh, Stompa shakes the ground. Who knew? Yeah, she is pretty strong. I don't need to be reminded of that. Hmm. I did notice that she stomps the ground pretty hard to make those tremors of hers. Maybe I can use that to my advantage. Uh, she's unstoppable for, for, for the power of love, which conquers all. Uh, well, it might have worked out for Mr. Miracle and Big Barter, but Stompa's not really my type. Maybe somebody else could give it a shot. Any volunteers? Uh, apparently you can't beat Stompa. She's too strong. Thanks. That's real helpful. Fills me with nothing but confidence. Uh, Stompa seems to use special antimatter boots. So that's where she gets her powers from, huh? I wonder if there's some sort of female fury supply closet that I can sabotage to take her down a peg. Seems Maybe. like she relies on a combination of those antimatter boots and her own strength to perform those tremor attacks. Yep. If I could tamper with the batteries she needs, then hopefully she'll stomp herself exhausted trying to get them to work. That's when I'll catch her off guard. <laughs> Thanks for the help. Uh, good luck, you'll I'm need it. No one will mind if I take this. All right, bronze tiger. Very cool. Sorry, I didn't mean to beat you up. Uh, but what else can we do around here? I mean, there's still the gold brick. There's still this fight, and then maybe we could go inside of here, and that will be more. Dark side's throne room. I mean, it doesn't say there's anything in there. One thing I did want to check is when I was up here, I did notice there's something to charge up here. I don't know what this is. It's to this, it's just something, but not something on the map. Or we're gonna find out what it is. It is money. Uh, sure, I'll take it. <laughs> Bunches of studs, can't complain about that. But was that really all it was? Yeah, I suppose so. It looks like there's something glowing, yeah, behind it. Um, Cause I think that there might be other missions we can do that don't show up on the map that we have to get done eventually too for the 100% completion. I might start working on those soon. Yeah, right here at the nose. What is, I think this is another one of the hugging things. Can I not reach in there? Cause if I can't, then I don't know how to get in. Cause I can't get in from this side. Like I can do that. But I can't like, just squeeze in there. You know what? I think I might know what to do. Hold on, not that, I just want you to fly. I don't know whenever I'd have a practical use for that super jump, it always gets in the way. If we switch to Zebra Man, we can make him shrink down. Not what I wanted. Also not what I wanted. Here, hop back on top of this, or not. There we go. How do we shrink you down again? Is, is shrinking down something I can't do on demand? Are you serious? Okay, I don't care then. I do not care. This game is really silly sometimes. It drives me nuts. I want you to change characters. Don't look at me like I'm silly. You're the silly one. Uh, Switch to Superman, sure, why not? We're gonna go ahead and try this gold brick again and see if it'll work now. Um, It may not, but it's worth a shot for sure. So flying over this way real fast. And, whoa, not in the lava. Is there anything or anyone over here? There still isn't. Sweetie, oh, oh, here we go. I might need to have a chat about how much of your work you've been bringing home with you. I'll talk to Mr. Nigma in the morning. By the way, have you seen the kids? I think they got spirited away by some flying demonic forces. They said they'd have their supper there, so we don't need to worry about that. Oh, that's nice. It'll be good for them to try some new foreign cuisine. Okay, um. I guess it is living apocalypse now. Let's see if we can help them out a little bit. We're gonna first move this. And then we need to switch to Riddler, I think, so that we can get people to team up with us. Not what I wanted, very obviously. Uh, oh, there's more stuff to telekinetically move, so we'll do that first. Is that all the telekinetic movements? I think so. So what I'm gonna do now is switch to, switch to Riddler, please. Very pretty please, huh? Okay. There we go. Why can't it be another button that changes characters that also doesn't change size? Like, I don't, I don't understand that. There's there's some extra buttons, I'm sure they could figure it out. Uh, so what can we do? We need four people over this way. So. Oh, Mr. Nigma, sir. Got it. I hope you're getting overtime for this. Yeah, I'm getting time off in lieu. That's illegal in the US private sector. We're not oh, in no. the US right now. Oh well. At least this key I found might lead to some fancy intergalactic treasure. Let's hope. 
And we're looking for one more. It's that lady over there that we saved. So I need you to move it, Zebra Man. Get out of here. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do that. No, wait, okay, we got you still. <laughs> That's all that matters. So. Oh, you can't do this, so. Do I have to switch to Joker? Uh, or are we missing a, a person, is that why? Well, it says we need four people. Gosh darn it. Uh, can Zebra Man like seriously get out of here? I don't want him to do that though. I just wanted to change characters. It's so weird. All I'm doing is holding triangle like I can do with every other character. Okay, switch you to Riddler now. If that's what I gotta do, that's what I gotta do. There's two characters so far. And then if I jump over this way, I can get you. And then can I get you or no? I cannot. So now that I've done that, in theory, I should be able to do something here with all four, right? No. What do you mean three out of four when there's only three people on the top? Does it mean that like Joker has to do it? I, no, don't, don't tell me. Don't tell me, hmm? What are you talking about? Uh, maybe because they're all with Riddler right now. That might actually be why. Okay, try it again. Still? No? Why? <laughs> I don't understand. Oh, wait, what? I didn't see that guy. Go ahead and save him. Uh, how can I save him? Why can some characters do a double jump and some just cannot? I don't know. Plop back down this way if I can. That's it. Can I break this? There we go, get back down here, buddy. And can I get you over here? I had to go right up to you. All right. A little bits at a time. That's it. Okay, we're all good. Get him over here. He's coming. I can handle that. All right, we're just waiting for him. There it is. Okay, they're making some kind of thing. Which Is this what you do all day at work? I suppose it is. Okay. There we go. Finally. Treasure. Oh, it's so beautiful. Uh, and of course we want you to have it, boss. Right, honey? Uh, of course. But it would have looked so good in our bathroom. Oh, sorry. Okay, so with that one done, there really is only one thing I can do over this way. Go ahead and do this one. What is it called, actually? Uh, Doomsday Disagreement. Is this Doomsday? Is that the same? Interesting. Uh, we're going to go ahead and switch to a flying character. And see what ends up happening. So, for this one, Nothing Hi. I'm going to destroy you all. Is is this a bad time? No, it's great. All right, let's fight. What are you doing? Oh, we already got one heart down. That was easy. This guy is actually not that scary so far. I've Keep fighting. Always been here, and I will always be here. Oh no. Uh. Making you wash the dishes, spoiling the twists in movies. You can't get rid of me. Oh, well, we got to. That was really easy. <laughs> he couldn't even finish his monologue before we defeated him. I've stolen better than this before. All right, so super duper cool. We take a look. I, I sort of want to unlock him. I mean, at this point, there's only one and two other characters on this character grid we technically haven't gotten so far. How crazy is that? And. That must mean they're in here, right? So let's go ahead and put a quick travel over to Darkseid Side's throne room and try going in if we can. There we go. I've never, okay, we've been in here in the main story. I don't really know what's going on in here now. Give the statue a makeover, sure. Uh, whoa. Or we're just adding stuff to it. Okay. Oh, rainbows and cotton candy, I get it. And I love Superman. <laughs> Great. Um, did that do anything for us? How weird is this? So where are those last two characters I'm missing? I'm not sure. That's where, this is where things get weird. Um, 
Oh, what's this over here? This is another one of those things. Okay. Hmm. I don't see too much else in here. This is very bizarre. So honestly, at this point, oh, and that's what that thing in the bottom right is. It's all those challenges, right? That's why it's one out of nine now, because I found all of the character things, maybe? I don't know, we'll have to go and check that out. I don't know where the other five spray paints are, either. Um, Can I leave? Yeah, let's leave. Because all everything else that shows up, then, it can't be something that's found on the map? As far as I can tell, yeah, because everything else has a check mark next to it. How weird is that? So everything else we have to find, we can still find it. Or we'll is it to find it oh, man, some other I'm way? I mean, say that. Here you are. Okay, you weren't here a moment ago. What's up? Uh, I'm done hanging out in Apocalypse. Dark Side is nowhere near as much fun as I thought he'd be. But before I go, I want to break in and get a picture of me sitting on his throne. Oh, sounds fun. I do this myself, but I want it to look candid. I don't want people thinking I'm into selfies or nothing. So will you give me a hand? Sure. All right, accept the All mission. Right. Let's make our way to the throne room. You got it. So go into the throne room. He's here waiting for us, but so is their defenses. All right. Are these guys even trying? I have no clue. Ready? Boom. That did not hit anybody. Moving over this way, who do we got, who do we got? More of them, excellent. Oh, sorry, supposed to be on your side. Okay, we gotta go up here, and then grab this blue set real fast. Oh, sorry, so clumsy, whoa, whoa, falling through the floor, I don't like that. All right, oh, there's more of them. Are these some of uh, the, the Furies? All right, go ahead and get this lady, and I think we're good. Okay, cool. So let's take a photo. Okay, yeah, uh, get one of me like this. Um, sure. It says there's another gray arrow. There's another character up there. Uh, was that good enough for you? No, I gotta take another one. Let me go ahead and take it. Like, oh, I can't switch the orientation actually. Was that good? Last one, last one. Okay. That should do it. There it is. Now let me see. Show me. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. These are great. Thanks for the help, partner. I'll add you to my buddies list so you can check out my new profile. Catch you around. All right. So we got the trophy uh, helping hand or something like Perhaps that. So there we go. We got another character unlocked. I think it might actually unlock him. That was. Uh, of course, Lobo. He was like narrating the uh, Justice League levels. Main man, Lobo. Oh, and he can fly? Whoa! <laughs> he rides a little dolphin. The main man's coming. And then up here, this wasn't, I didn't see this yeah, on the arrow before. Another character, but no, there's still somebody else we're missing. Okay, um, who is, it's locked. Um, But there was another character up there. Very cool, I was able to find him. Um, So with that being said, what else is going on? Um, where could I have missed something? Maybe there's another one? But if that was my helping hand thing, I don't know. So, we still have some time left in today's episode. File finder, it's saying that there's one last one. Some of you were saying, none that if I go here, no, no, here, these are all of our challenges, and one of these is the file finder. And with this one, this tells me where all of the hidden characters with the uh, little suitcases are. So which one are we missing? I'll just leave my notes here near these two large tubes. See a whole lot of inmates transforming inside those lately. Oh, that could be anywhere. I have no clue where that is. So that's probably somewhere I just very clearly missed, probably inside of a building somewhere. So I guess we'll go and do that. If there's nothing more I can do here in Apocalypse, which it doesn't seem like there is. Oh my gosh, he's so cool. Um, So yeah, let's teleport out of here. Um, Oh, look. I didn't know you could do this. Earth room tube, or earth boom tube. Map points found 100%, gold bricks collected 100%. Okay. Does that mean for here, or for, I think that means for here. That's a nice little marker to have. Wish I knew that was here sooner. Um, Let's go ahead and figure this out. Travel to earth. Okay, very cool. So we've made some splendid progress in today's episode, getting impressively close to 100%, and that is amazing. So um, at this rate, what else is there to do? Um, I'm sure we can figure it out 
But yeah, this might be the last episode of the free play, technically. We'll have to wait and see. Um, if we can get to 100% completion by buying everything, then we'll definitely do that. Um, but in the meantime, we're just flying away. Flying and flying. But that doesn't mean we're exactly done with the series, even if we get to complete this episode, next episode, whatever. Um, because I still need to get all the DLC done. So we'll be doing that too. There's still lots of Lego action happening soon. We're still flying to the to the, to the Earth. It's taken a while. And we made it. So one thing I want to quickly check then. If I go here and select this again, it doesn't work. Uh, yeah. Uh, maybe it's because I'm right there. Let me try flying away real fast. And then, no wait, wrong button. What the heck, that's not what I was trying to do. Okay, here we go. Monuments vandalized, 0%. But is that here or back at Apocalypse? That's where it's a little bit uncertain. <laughs> I don't know which monuments we can vandalize. We're gonna have to figure that one out. But that's probably where the five spray painting things are. What marker is here? Oh, you know, I made a marker on the door, duh. Um, so yeah, if there's anything I can do at the moment, it's going to be trying to figure out where that next thing is. So let's get to it. <gasps> oh, there it is, okay, so I had to do this the hard way. Obviously, since there was no gray arrow out in the overworld, that meant that in, some, in one of the buildings was going to be the thing. So I went into every building trying to find the gray arrow, and here it is. There we go, and it is Detective Chimp. So there we go, technically every character is unlocked. I think that's what we're gonna be doing right now. We have our another gold brick for that too, 187 in total. So I think that means that the rest of the gold bricks are, already be, go, are going to all be through the challenges, which I think is something I'm gonna tackle in the next episode episode then, because um, it might take me a little while to get all those done. So this is what we're gonna do then. Um, we got our second of those trophies, um, as you can see, actually not. I don't know what that thing on the bottom right is. Oh, that's what messing with his throne was. Gotcha, so we need to go around and find other gold brick things like that, and then also five of the things. I don't know, where, that's what we'll find out next episode. For right now, I'm gonna do something pretty special, I think, and that's going to be uh, buying all the characters, so we can get all these characters purchased. Uh, purchased. If you wanna see me go through these characters and read about each one, because if you press triangle, you can see some info about them like this. Um, I'm gonna be doing that, uh, in an, its own episode, because that's gonna take a while to do. But I think that'll be super worth it, so we'll be doing that at some point. But I wanted to at least get this done so we can see what our percentage is. Now, okay, well this is Detective Champ, guy we just unlocked. He looks really cool, I like him. Um, okay, go back around here, and keep buying all these characters. Some of them are really cheap, but like, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, come on, come on. Some of them are like 10,000, some of them are 150,000. Obviously, we're not gonna be spending four billion studs right now, so no matter what we do, we should be fine. Here we go, we can buy all these guys. Got it, got it. And it's super satisfying to be able to do this without even having to sweat it. It's a lot of fun, and then we'll also do the same thing for all the vehicles, and I'll be having an in-depth showcase of them all at some point in the future once everything else is fully complete and we know for a fact we don't have to worry about anything, and that's gonna be cool. Um, For now, Keep buying all these, get all of these as well. It's turning out pretty good. No wait, okay, I was almost done too. And we're still well over four billion studs. I mean, we, yeah, we're not even gonna scratch below. That's not what I meant to do. Anyways, I think the rest of them might actually just be creative characters. Uh, yeah, that's just a creative character. All right, all together now, yep, that's it. So technically, I have 100% of all characters, and if we take a look at the menu, I'm not 94.3%. Like I said, we're not quite done. I'm gonna go over this way and check out what vehicles I can buy. Just like that, buy these two, and buy that thing, and buy this thing. Got it. And all of these. Awesome, this one's still locked for whatever reason. Don't know where I find that. That's a bit weird. Um, okay, I bought, purchased everything I could purchase at the moment. I don't see any other races around here, but maybe they're around somewhere. But also the races take up a gray arrow as well. So I don't know if to figure that out at some point, but for now we have 97.6%. That is amazing. So yeah, we made some great progress finishing up Apocalypse and hopefully we can go for the 100% completion in the next episode of LEGO DC Super Villains. If you watch this point of video, make sure you comment Dark Side Zebra Sony Watch at the end of the UA Zebra Tastic Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now, or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time.
拜。